everybody. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Thanks for tuning in to today's review. As you can see, it's that time of the day where we're going to do another in-depth review. So if you're new on this channel, please make sure to like, share, comment and subscribe. Please make sure to check out some of my old content. By all means, check out what I've got up and kind of get some idea of what I base my channel on. Right, with all that said out of the way, what we're looking at today is a Nike Dunk Low. So the story behind this one was the reason why I've actually wasn't able to actually get hold of this because what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to complete my fruit pack. I believe it's just something that they're trying to hype up for the upcoming uh, fruity pack that we'll be probably having and that's from the SB range. It's something to look out for. I did actually put it up in my last video. Please make sure to check that out. What we did was we looked at the avocados and same all over again. What they've done with this one is they've mimicked the fruit of a banana. As I keep saying again, as we had the same with the avocados, and I believe this is part of the fruit pack. Also, I think it's that hype that they're just building up because we'll be getting the SB range, which is also dubbed as the fruity pack. And that will be based on four sneakers with four different colorways. Uh, I will put a picture up of some of the dunks that we'll be getting in that range. And this is what they will look like. So moving on to the box label, we have got a colorway of coconut milk, vivid sulfur. So, moving on with this review, here is your first look on this channel, the Nike Dunk Low Banana. So, I believe this is the second pair to complete the fruit pack that we recently had with the first one. And it's probably to hype up the upcoming fruity pack that we'll be having from the sb range uh, basically they will be based on three silhouettes three sb dunks three different colors and the fourth one will be a high i believe also make sure to take any of my information on my channel with a pinch of salt it may not all be accurate there might be bits that i've missed and if there is anything that you feel that i've missed please let me know in the comments down below and that's the whole point of this review and my channel is to basically help you out there to find that perfect sneaker so as i mentioned before i believe this is part of the dunk fruity pack this is the second pair we've had. Uh, same again, what they've done, they've mimicked a banana. Uh, as you can see from the colours, it's basically the inside of a banana. So when you actually peel off a banana and you reveal the actual fruit, they're the kind of colours that they've gone with. Uh, feeling the toe box and the, and the toe trims and the side panel, uh, most of it is of... Uh, sort of an off-white new book material. Looking at your shoelaces, you've got your standard flat shoelaces coming sort of like a sail colourway. Really, really nice. Same colour as the actual upper. The midsole is also the same colour as is the outsole also. The swoosh, it's like a yellow colour. And you've got this uh, rear heel panel with these flaps along the side which in my opinion mimics the skin of a banana looking at the side panel again towards the rear of the sneaker on the side you can see this fruit sticker uh, same again like i mentioned in the avocados this is a fruit sticker that you'd normally get on a load of fruit. Also, I don't know if you caught a glimpse of the back heel tab uh, where the Nike branding is. Um, basically, the rear, in my opinion, kind of reminds me of 
the branch of a banana. Now, if you, if you don't know what I mean, I, I, I'll put a picture up. It's basically where you break off the actual banana, and it kind of just, it kind of mimics that, in my opinion. I don't know. I mean, leave some comments down below if you if you feel the same. But that's what I feel if, if you're looking at it from sort of the back end uh, obviously looking at it from the front you've got all the actual banana once it's all been peeled and then uh, towards the back of the sneaker you've got the actual banana skin to be honest i'm actually glad that we're doing this review and we're actually looking at this sneaker uh, as i said I, I feel it's part of a dunk fruit pack i keep talking about the avocados uh, uh like i said i'm glad we're doing this review on this uh, banana pack and basically what i mean by that is what i've learned about the avocado dunk <sighs> it's actually a wear away you've got your tear aways which obviously we discussed in one of my last videos and that was on the uh, sb dunk paisleys uh basically what they've done uh, with the avocado is the all the, the whole of the upper is actually wear away not tear away wear away now there was actually a video on youtube someone actually put up of them using some sort of tool to actually grind away that upper material of the of the uh, uh, of the actual uh, of the actual color that sort of mimics the avocado the skin of the avocado which i thought was really really cool uh but to be honest uh looking at the picture and uh, judging by how he actually grinded his way through the sneaker nah i'm not having it to be honest uh, I, it's something i wouldn't really do it doesn't actually look very nice to be honest as well i'll put a picture up i did manage to find a picture of it uh, i can't actually find the video i would have actually loved to attach this the video to this uh, to this review uh, so you you would have had a look at that i couldn't find the video so i've had to crack on with the actual review but anyway here's a picture of the actual avocado dunk that was actually worn away with this sort of tool uh, this electronic tool that they used uh, but as i say it was a power tool that they used sorry uh, but yeah have a look at that <laughs> it looked really strange in my opinion right so i'm about to wrap this video up as of now i think i've covered about everything there's probably loads of bits that i've missed please make sure to drop some comments down below uh, keep me up to date with anything as well by all means, obviously it's for you. Obviously you learn as well as I learn. So please make sure to hit some comments down below if you have any questions or if you want to tell me as well about the actual sneaker that I didn't cover. So yeah, thanks for tuning in to today's review. I hope you've learned something off this video. Make sure to smash that subscribe button and that notification button to stay up to date with any of my videos. And also keep on top of the game hope to catch you again on my next video until then see you later